Good morning, everybody. Uh, sorry about dumping so many videos on you yesterday. Uh, I just kind of shot a little bit of everything and uh, sat down last night, put it all together and realized, dang, I got six videos. Uh, I hope you enjoyed them. Today, I got a few odd jobs I'm going to work on. Uh, I got a couple cans of paint here and I got some painter's tape. And let me show you what we're going to paint. This is the fire hydrant out in front of our house. Um, it is yellow and red. Now, I called the fire department and our meter should be solid red. Um, I wanted to take the high pressure hose and blast this and get all of the loose paint off. But as you remember from one of the videos yesterday, I've buried everything in the shed and there's no way to get to that uh, pressure washer. So what I'm going to do is just go ahead and shoot some red paint on it, get it looking nice. And then uh, next year in the spring, we'll bring the pressure washer out. Well, probably when we do the driveway and, and uh, seal the driveway and we'll pressure wash this off, get all the loose paint off of it. And... Uh, We'll paint it again so let me get set up before i get set up i wanted to mention one thing you're probably wondering why in the world are you painting the meter shouldn't the city do that and yeah the city does do it periodically every couple of years they come through and they'll paint the meters uh, the reason why i'm doing it is my wife uh, my kids have a bunch of these uh, outdoor yard ornaments they blow up you know they have little fans in them for christmas you know little santa clauses things like that and my wife just thought this was the cutest thing. She bought one that is a Dalmatian, and he's got a fire hat on. So she wants to set the uh, the inflatable next to the hydrant because she thought it would be cute. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever. So that's that's fine with me. So uh, I told her I'd shoot some paint on it so it looked halfway decent. And that way, when, when Thanksgiving's over and we start decorating the yard, uh, we can set that inflatable up right next to the fire hydrant, and uh, everything should look great. All right. Let me get set up now. I'll, I'll come back and see you again in just a minute. I got the meter all taped up. Uh, I don't know if you ever tried to tape chain before, but it's not really easy. <laughs> I wrapped some paper around it and then just used some painter's tape to hold the paper in place. Uh, I did notice that they didn't worry too much about getting the paint on the chain whenever they painted it the first time. Uh, I was just trying to keep it somewhat clean. But I've got the meter ready to paint, so what I'm going to do is uh, get the paint can shook up and then we'll start shooting some paint.
Well, I got the meter painted. It looks really good. I'm going to show it to you here in a minute uh, because I'm worried that when I filmed it, I may have accidentally hit the slow mo button, which <laughs> would mean that the video was recorded in extreme slow motion. I hope that's not the case. So let me flip this camera around and show you what I've got. It's actually a cardinal red, and uh, there's a reason why it's cardinal red. Those of you who watch a lot of my videos will understand. Um, it looks really good. I'm going to let it sit and dry for a while before I try to take the tape and the uh, paper off of it, simply because I don't want to get you know paint all over my hands and I don't want to mess up the job that I did. But uh, I'm real happy with how it turned out. So 100% better than it did, and uh, we're ready to start decorating with uh, our uh, fire dog of our Dalmatian fire dog inflatable. <laughs> Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.